everyone uh, today our lesson is uh, HTML uh, first let's see what is HTML actually HTML is uh, used to develop web pages HTML uh, mean uh, <coughs> hypertext markup language uh, this is not a computer language as Pascal. Uh, this is this language used to develop the uh, web pages. Actually, uh, HTML uh, gives the instructions to a web browser. These uh, instructions can read the web browser. So, uh, the need of this HTML is to create web pages collection of web pages we call as website so now let's see uh, how to develop this website uh, for that I open uh, actually we create this web pages using uh, notepad here I open the notepad so I type it as notepad then uh, we get the notepad here and uh, this is notepad so a web page can be divided into two as uh, head part and body part so I'll write it here uh, first HTML uh, actually I can write this in uh, simple letters or capital letters both that mean no, uh, no case sensitive uh, so it is easy uh, to write in uh, simple because otherwise I have to use always caps lock so I will write it as HTML uh, then head 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 uh, then next TITLE title uh, so I will use the uh, this website on uh, Anuradhapura. So I write the uh, title as Anuradhapura or oh, Polonara. I can use that even. So I write it Polonara as yes. Now this is my web page title, and uh, when we open a tag, this is we call as these are we call as tags. <coughs> Normally we keep. Uh, the tags in uh, the these tags uh, these angle brackets we use the words in angle brackets uh, does not show in web browsers so uh, when I open I have to close it so I'll write it here uh, close uh, title to close I use this backslash uh, title okay and the same I have to close head if we open a tag then we have to close that tag uh, head uh, yes now but I don't uh, keep the HTML here because uh, uh, HTML when we close the HTML end of the uh, end of the web page so I'll use it here and close it right <coughs> this is the head part of this uh, website and I'll use body here B -O -D -Y, body okay now I can save this web page uh, for that this is the step that uh, we uh, save the web page go to file save or save as I can take any of these because this is the first time I save so I can use save or save as anyway I use save as and here we have to use the name for this web page normally we use this uh, as to recognize easily I use as uh, oh, no, uh, this is the name of the uh, web page and dot html you know why we use this uh, extension html then the computer knows that 
this file that means the file that we are going to create should be open using uh, Google Chrome uh, that means web browser actually not only the uh, Google Chrome because I always use here Google Chrome so I can use it uh, but any web browser you can use so uh, save as type I should uh, use as all file types and here <coughs> uh, in this uh, new version uh, you need not to uh, change this so that means you can use sing hello english both otherwise i have to use in uh, if we use in old version uh, this nc uh, format but here we need not that we can use both this utf uh, so i save this in uh, folder so i'll create here a folder uh, i can use this uh, document in document I create a folder uh, I can use here uh, new folder and write there uh, HTML uh, this is my web page uh, and I open this and save the web page there so my now my web page is in document uh, I can open it like this uh, here document uh, this is the web page so uh, if I uh, create this in uh, desktop it is very easy for me so uh, actually it is better to use a in desktop mm, because there are some more uh, folders here in HTML that's why I use the uh, document but I save it again here uh, desktop because I always need to get this folder open this folder uh, otherwise I can uh, use it document so I will again make a folder here <coughs> HTML HT ML I use three because there are some more HTML uh, and uh, okay I open this and uh, again I use all files and here I use again dot HTML save <coughs> okay now what happened here uh, let's see a folder yes this is the folder I take it here uh, now let's open this and see what is there uh, this is Polonna Rua and open that web page now you can see this is the heading or the title of the web page normally we call this uh, row as uh, as the uh, title bar so this is the title of this web page so I can uh, minimize this like this and uh, I use it here and I can close this uh, <coughs> uh, here is my uh, web page now uh, and in uh, whenever I need I can get this web page uh, so I minimize it now you can see uh, this is what we got that he in head part we wrote the title of the web page here we have the title as Polo Narva uh, and now there is no in body area so I am going to write the tags there uh, first I need here uh, a title uh, sorry heading for that so I write uh, ruin city this is the uh, title of my web page and I can save this always when we write the uh, tags uh, here uh, or quotes 
uh, definitely we have to save them now you can notice that uh, the tags within tags the text or the tags does not appear here but the uh, text that we write without these tags appear here so I uh, save I can save it here as this save and hereafter I use control s for save uh, and I can refresh this using this reload or refresh for that I can use control R uh, any of this I can use here now you can see here ruin city polon uh, actually uh, this is the default size of this uh, text but we can uh, command we can give a command uh, to this uh, uh, web browser uh, here like this h1 h1 is a tag that we use to make the uh, make this uh, h1 h1 uh, heading h1 mean the heading so I can save it here h1 save and here refresh you see this is what uh, heading ruin city polon narua uh, and I can uh, I told you that when we open uh, tag we have to close that uh, but I don't close it here and I will show you what is happening here so I copy this uh, the same text uh, one two three four five six yes there are seven h uh, seven headings <coughs> I use this heading as h uh, two three four five six seven uh, I must delete first seven now you can see this I'll uh, save this to save I use uh, control s control s here I can use control r you see what happened there this is the uh, heading this is heading 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 uh, these two uh, actually these two are not heading uh, because uh, if it is heading this uh, this should come under uh, now I'll again copy one more seven and eight then can then you can see what happened there uh, this is eight okay save and see you see uh, these headings normally come under one under the other up to six but from there it won't work uh, this six is the last heading that appear after that seven and eight that mean this one and this one are not the headings because they are normal uh, size that mean this heading works up to number six seven and eight does not work that's that's why it come across so now we can uh, close this h1 like this and it is uh, I can copy this and uh, but it is somewhat difficult to do that so I can easily uh, write it here h3 and here h4 h4 uh, like this let's see and save here uh, nothing difference there so uh, we can keep uh, I think still you cannot understand why we uh, need this open and close tags uh, 
but you understood that h1 is the biggest h1 is the biggest size of the uh, heading so uh, the necessity of this uh, to recognize is in your question paper there can be uh, this size uh, output that means uh, image of browser and you have to identify whether this uh, size h1 or h2 or h3 so you have to remember that h1 is the biggest uh, heading size and it uh, when uh, the size of the letter grow but it uh, becomes smaller so remember that and uh, now I remove all these six because I wanted to tell you that uh, the <coughs> what is this h1 tag and I save it here and goes here refresh uh, then I can choose this h1 tag uh, h1 and copy it here for ruin city and I remove this H1 and use the font tag the tag font uh, actually this font tag is not a lone tag there are through three groups that mean three parts of this uh, uh, H1 tag uh, sorry font tag uh, to make this uh, I can use this attribute size SI is a D size equal I use 8 yes now we can see that uh, and I uh, use here uh, close with font and I save it and let's go here you can see here uh, the difference between h1 tag and the uh, font tag both are used for uh, growing the uh, font size and uh, here only we can use h1 for growing the heading uh, but here this is actually as a heading because uh, it is bold and uh, uh, heading but here these uh, fonts are not bold so we have to use another tag for that b because this uh, font tag we can use anywhere but this h1 is used as when we use the uh, I'll, uh, refresh it now you see here I use b tag b for bold and then it became bold here for the h1 it won't uh, we need not use extra uh, tag as bold because this is for the heading normally heading is in bold now you can see this uh, ruin city polona ruin 8 size and and even I can use some uh, 10 just like and control less uh, it become uh, it won't work because there is a limit here <coughs> uh, normally this uh, 6 is the size of that yes uh, the same size uh, uh, no actually h1 is the bigger size uh, here we we need to understand is that h1 tag is the biggest tag but here uh, when we write the uh, larger number it grow uh, larger but there is a limit so you have to remember that if we need very large font then we have to use uh, some artwork and uh, copy and paste as an image ok now I told you that here is a uh, here is a, this tag has three parts actually this is this part is we call as element this is we call as attribute and this is the uh, value uh, so for this element under element there can be many attributes so I can use here another attribute as color C O L O R color but not the uh, C O O L O R color uh, not the mm, C O L O U R color uh, equal I can now you know that uh, the value 
always should be within inverted commas I use as a uh, green uh, now what I the uh, command that I gave is to the browser this is a browser uh, make the font green color let's see I save it control s and here refresh you see that uh, this web browser can understand what we write here so that's why it uh, uh, observe my command right then uh, next one uh, ne actually next uh, I can make it larger font size 6 uh, color green ruin city polo nadua here I use another attribute now you know that there are uh, element attribute and uh, value so I use another uh, attribute as uh, another attribute as uh, font face face a face e face font face equal after attribute always there is a uh, value uh, that mean equal after equal sign we get the value so I use this quotation uh, now you know that uh, we cannot remember the names of the font uh, for that I can uh, use word software and we can see uh, some <coughs> uh, yes it is coming here blank uh, here here are the some here are some names of the uh, font so I use this here you can uh, abide uh, let's see this and I copy it copy this name uh, because that's why I told you we cannot remember all the names of the type uh, font types actual font types in the face so I'll minimize it and use the name here that mean I copy it control V abigail and close let's see how is the type of this font face Ty uh, the, the design of the font for that I uh, minimize it and uh, refresh you see uh, how the abigail the font type so now let's understand this tag here is the uh, font element and under this uh, element we can use many attributes this is attribute that means size color is another attribute face is another attribute so uh, under these attributes there are values uh, this is the name of the font value this is the name of the color green this is the size of the font 6 uh, ok now I have to tell you that something about this color normally we use uh, hexadecimal values to express color in uh, computer uh, numbering system for that I can use hash hash is used for to tell that this is hexadecimal value normally uh, the need of hexadecimal number is to express uh, color so I use double F uh, zero zero sorry zero 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 that mean to express this color uh, you know that uh, in <coughs> uh, screen we use RGB colors R mean red G for green and uh, RGB for blue so I here use double F double F mean 255 is the uh, color range from 0 up to 255 there is a color range so I use that uh, and save now you can see now R is red G for green G for blue here I use double A for red now it become red here if I refresh you see here 
and if I uh, make here double F then uh, 0 0 and save you know now it become uh, it becomes green if I use this uh, instead of this one I again make it 0 0 uh, now you can understand uh, this letter become bluish color yes this is RGB color uh, actually uh, when we need uh, mix color we have to use here another value as one uh, C O B B is uh, a hexadecimal value and I refresh save and refresh uh, it did not uh, much difference I have to use somewhat bigger value like this control S yes so I will show you uh, this the number of this uh, uh, color for that I can use paint in this paint you see here color uh, now this is red green blue this is what I told you RGB colors now when the RGB color 0 0 always the uh, black so if I make this uh, uh, make my uh, notepad 0 0 0 then it become uh, then it become dark that means black color uh, yes uh, you see here yes it is ok now let's see uh, how we change the color uh, if I write here 250 255 then it is become red uh, now if I change this you can see mix color if I want some color like this uh, I have to uh, use this is actually uh, decimal color decimal number system so we have to convert this uh, decimal uh, to get this color we have we we need the hexadecimal value of these decimal values to get hexadecimal value we can easily use this uh, 146 146 is a decimal value uh, I use it here uh, decimal value uh, before that I must clear it decimal 100 146 uh, the hexadecimal value is 92 and likewise if I get the hexadecimal value I can make this color in a uh, notepad but we need the <coughs> but we need here the hexadecimal value uh, if I make uh, all double F double F what do you mean double F? Double F means 255 when we convert into hexadecimal double F. Uh, that is what here. Uh, now we know that uh, when all the zeros are black and if all the F mean the white color. Uh, so we can get this uh, I'll close this notepad. Uh, if I refresh you cannot see this letter. Why? because it became white the the font actually the font is here but we cannot it is not appear as I gave white so that's why I told you here I use double zero then uh, here are two mixing mixture of color red and green red and green actually I don't know what is the color when mix red and green you can see that yes yellow color okay this is how uh, the color uh, works and I again use these two zeros so we can uh, give directly a name of the color anyway I'll keep it here okay I think now you it is clear that the font tag font tag what are the things that we can do with the font tag right uh, next tag I use here uh, marquee 
M A R Q U W E marquee. Uh, I use this marquee uh, to make this letter. Uh, and uh, yes, actually I need this H1 uh, again. Uh, but I make this H1 because uh, actually I use this marquee to move this uh, ruin city, Polon Narua. Uh, and I change this uh, marquee and let's see first what is marquee H1 uh, and you see a marquee what happened to the marquee uh, refresh ah yes why we why it does not work because the wrong spelling so you have you must very careful of spelling M A R Q U W E marquee uh, now it may work I save it then go to refresh yes you see this is what we call as uh, marquee <coughs> now you can understand why we want to close open and close uh, actually I want to use this marquee for uh, ruin city polonar only but uh, the both of these headings move so to stop this I must close uh, here here I close this as marquee and I can use the same spelling and the uh, uh, tag and copy paste here yes control s refresh now you see stop because I close the tag here now I think you can understand what is this open and close uh, tags mean open in and close so uh, if I use here somewhat just like uh, four, uh, the uh, the the font size may decrease and refresh. Yes, this size is enough for that. And next, I want to uh, do the changes for this uh, web pages to insert an image. Yes, I can insert image like this for that I use this uh, tag img src this is also what the in this tag also there are three uh, parts but this is the tag which haven't uh, three parts uh, only b uh, h1 also there is no uh, three parts in that tag but font tag there are three parts that mean the element attribute and the value here is also the same thing img is the element src is the uh, attribute and after attribute we can uh, remember need the equal sign and uh, value must be in e e e uh, quotation so uh, src now I need to input some image so there are some images here I have store some images in my uh, picture folder I go to this picture folder and uh, we can get this uh, images uh, here we must give this uh, web browser the path or where this image is so this image is actually we can uh, see the path when we go to properties we can find the path this is the location location mean where this image is so I copy this image because uh, to get this image to the browser browser should know where this uh, image okay I copy it and paste it here actually I uh, got the path only but not the name of the image I think uh, you notice it here ag again I go to the image this is the name of the image Anura so the type of this image is JPG you can see here here this uh, file format that means the f file format of this uh, image is JPG uh, when we use the JPG file format is to upload images for the internet because uh, this JPG file format is not uh, quality or uh, very good quality images we don't use this JPG file format uh, 
so I use this Anura the name of the image is Anura for that I have to use this forward slash like this and name is Anura and the file format is JPG uh, and I'll close using this uh, quotation mark uh, then I must give uh, the height and the width or the size of the image uh, width w i d t h width mean the width of the width equal again another uh, attribute width and this is the uh, value width uh, let's say somewhat uh, 200 and height of the image I must give a height so h e i g h t height uh, equal mm, let's say height this in uh, normally the stopper I got the stopper stopper is uh, somewhat wide uh, and tall so I'll make it narrow I will give a uh, smaller size like this 175 uh, it should be in quotation I use here quotation uh, now I can close this uh, with the angle brackets okay now see the uh, <coughs> full tag here img src this is element only one element under one element we can use many uh, attributes this is attribute this is attribute this is attribute so img src uh, this means the image name of the image anura.jpg this is the location of the uh, this image actually if I keep this image in my uh, folder I need not to do this uh, I need not to uh, show the location or the path just I can use uh, anura.jpg so you have to remember that but we have we must give size of the image like this width and height uh, so now I save this control S and uh, let's go to the web page and uh, see it I close this uh, close this and this is my web page I open it and uh, refresh now you see this image is uh, across that mean as a in the same line normally when we write something in the notepad uh, whether we uh, change whether we make a break it won't uh, uh, that mean if I go to next line and write uh, it won't work here you can see that uh, I write this image after here here but it won't work if I uh, enter and write normally we enter to get the next line but uh, this browser don't go like that because we must give command we must command the browser these are the commands in tags so I must tell that also what is that to go to next line that means the tag is br br tag always br tag is used for uh, here you can notice that uh, normally we is use this backslash to close the tag but here uh, I use end of the letter end of the uh, term or the tag this uh, backslash because these are the types of tags uh, we call them as uh, empty tags or the uh, uh, blind tags because these tags there are no open and close type these in this uh, tags there are no open or close type actually this image image also it is also not a open and close type tag so I think you can remember this marquee is a open and close type tag uh, this font is also a, you can see here font is also a open and close I close it here and I open it here but this image tag there is no opening or no closing uh, just it is a tag it is a one tag uh, so these types of tags are called as empty tags or blind tags this is also a type of that tag this tag br tag is used to uh, go to next line now I will save this here file save and let's see uh, what happened to the 
yes now you can see that uh, I want this uh, my web page should be the uh, center that means this uh, ruin city for should be here and image should be here for that again I must command for that also I must give a command what should be that command center so I write it here uh, actually I can write here after marquee also because marquee is just move though I asked to be center it won't work you can see this <coughs> center okay now save and I refresh you see uh, the ma I wrote here center but marquee after that there is marquee marquee, ma marquee is always move so it is not applicable for this but for these two it is applied that means uh, the heading of the web page also center and the image also center now you can see here there is some there is no space in between these uh, two lines again I can use a uh, again I can use some uh, space here here I can use another space here then there must be uh, more space in between these tags and the image you see now I use two br tags that mean this is mean break uh, if I use two breaks you can see here what happened here there is space uh, let's refresh yes if I use another then it goes here like that uh, these are the two tags I use for this br tag then uh, next one is I want to use here a, a line actually this line should be here like this I need a line uh, how should I use that line is uh, HR tag I can use HR tag here after this image uh, after this image I use the HR tag uh, yes HR now you see here this is HR tag uh, and I save it now you now you can remember can you remember what is the name of these types of uh, tags yes this is also MTO blind tag because this is also not a open and close type tag uh, just for uh, rule that mean HR mean horizontal ruler the ruler mean this rule uh, I can give for this HR tag some more attributes and values HR mean horizontal ruler this uh, this rule I can give some size SI uh, is a D size uh, equal uh, uh, let's say 3 yes now the same tag that mean uh, the HR tag was earlier uh, blind tag that mean empty tag but I made it as the uh, three parts tag because I use some attributes and the value uh, there are very few tags like that uh, this H1 tag we cannot do that but here it I here we can do that <coughs> now let's see what happened to the uh, line okay you see it became uh, thick but it does not appear as it is white color so I must give a color for this so I use here uh, color C-O-L-O-R color equal equal what should be the color uh, green color okay no blue color right B-L-U-E blue and I can use this hexadecimal value and the name both but here it is easy because very quickly we can write this uh, word uh, okay yes you see here it became uh, the line this line became blue color and uh, if I give a width to this color and also I can add some more 
attribute just like width 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 equal 500 uh, you can understand what is this width easily uh, save and refresh you see this what happened there 500 mean the uh, if I use without any width it goes from this end to this end uh, as I use the value it is 500 no usually usually this square uh, screen thousand but this is as wide screen my computer screen wide uh, it is more than thousand so you can check that uh, when you are doing this uh, uh, practical okay again I go to my notepad you see here HR uh, tag and then I I am going to <coughs> use another uh, tag that is uh, uh, that is yes I want to give a link to this page link to, to this page so to give a link I must write something here ok I write it here using paragraph I am going to write a paragraph uh, to write paragraph I use the tag P P for paragraph P uh, ok I write it here uh, follow Narua who is very uh, old ok that's enough old city in Sri Lanka uh, so when I ok now I want to give a um, here I will write this uh, oh uh, it is better I can use this without uh, yes ok ok no problem then I use here that link link mean when I click on this Sri Lanka uh, I can go to website about Sri Lanka so uh, I write it here as a h r e f uh, equal equal uh, here we must give some uh, name of the web site actually uh, I can go to here here are some another web pages so I can use one of those web page uh, uh, ok this is our uh, HTML page uh, I can use some another web page here uh, then we can give a, a link to that web page this is Anuradhapura I take that uh, web page and paste here you see here this is the name of the web page anuradhapura.html that is html document so I, I am going to use uh, the I am going to use this uh, link to that page ok uh, let's see how to keep uh, make that link href uh, the name of that web, pa uh, web page is anuradhapura so I will write it here like this uh, href here here I write quotation anu ra let's see the spelling correct spelling should be a capital uh, otherwise it won't uh, ok I'll show you that if it is simple low capital it won't uh, find out anurad pure dot html ok I'll close the tag uh, close the inverted inverted commas and close the tag and here uh, I use this a a is the element here that's why I use only that uh, ok refresh now let's see what is happening there this is a tag uh, I use for uh, <coughs> paragraph 
uh, when, if my paragraph end here I can use another uh, end tag like this uh, you see here this is uh, p4 paragraph Polo Naru is a very old city in in uh, Sri Lanka uh, when I click on Sri Lanka it goes to this web page that is happening here and I close this link otherwise everything I write here become link uh, and for that I can write here Sri Lanka uh, which is a beauty whole C-O-U-N-T-R-Y country okay that's enough uh, okay I will make a break here uh, okay okay let's see now save and go here I know that it won't work here yes uh, this is what happened here uh, Polonnaru is very old city in Sri Lanka which is a beautiful country now this became the uh, now you see here it shows the part, uh, web page here okay I thought that as it is simple and rather it won't come but it works okay I will click it here yes this is the uh, page that uh, I created earlier this is in our folder so I need not to give the path otherwise I should give the path uh, to this website now we know that how to give the path uh, get the properties and find the path okay this is our uh, website that we build uh, when we this has the same image you might think then the same one but this is Anuradhapura city our web page is uh, Rowin city Polonnaru okay uh, now you see how we make a link actually we can use this link to a uh, uh, link to a website also uh, as there is uh, internet we can go there I will on uh, yes I will on my internet uh, connect internet and show you how to go to the website for that I will write here website name of the website let's say a NIE website uh, I, I use here instead of this web page I use uh, NIE website okay www.nie.lk let's see whether it goes to this website that means when I click on Sri Lanka it goes to this website earlier we go to that uh, web page that we build up here then we go to a uh, website let's see whether it works uh, sorry uh, still it goes there let's see what happened there actually I think I did not uh, save it control S ah yes your file was not found that mean there should be some more for this uh, web uh, URL I will write HTTP that mean I must mention the protocol HTTP uh, double slash okay I think now it will work now you see earlier I gave www.ni.lk but there is no protocol so I must mention the protocol save uh, and go to the website again refresh why why there is no okay it is connected let's see what is happening there www.http uh, double slash nie dot lk save uh, I think I make it correct but why it won't work refresh ah yes okay now this is our uh, website ni.lk that mean on uh, the web page here so this is our web page when uh, the link is okay now because uh, there should be this HTTP uh, that mean 
full uh, URL should be here we have to write now I think you notice these things uh, how we make these things uh, the very basic things in a uh, website uh, then we go to make a list here here is a list I will make this uh, paragraph break into two because it is fairly long and difficult to uh, control that's why I make it uh, as a two cent uh, paragraph but it, but uh, all do I make it two as a two, two sentences so the paragraph make into next line uh, here it won't work here is in one okay you see uh, here is all do I refresh uh, the one okay next one is uh, I want to make here uh, list so there are two list as uh, o l o l o l mean ordered list and for this uh, list I can make the names of these ruined cities just like uh, l i for l i for list uh, Anuradhapura the pure and I close the list now you know what is this open and close tags uh, then uh, I will write I will copy this and paste because uh, I can use some more uh, name so I can leave these names as mm, okay I'll write here Kurunagal or Dambadiniya somewhere else uh, just like Kurunagal okay I save it here and uh, I can uh, close the list till I backslash uh, OL close ok now you see this is a ordered list uh, let's see how is the output this is the output actually this output is because the uh, all these are in center but I need this uh, list should be left aligned so I close this center tag you see here center tag we haven't closed it yet so I close it here close center center and save yes you see here it became align left because normally default is align left if I need to get this right align I must tell here uh, oil uh, right align make uh, right align ok now this is 1 2 3 numbers how can you see here a b c yes I must give a oil type so I can type here oil type t y p e type equal oil type equal within quotation A O L type equal A uh, then let's see you see A B C if I use here capital A it, then there is capital A uh, if I use here uh, uh, I then I mean here actually Roman numbers uh, 1 2 3 so it becomes like this 1 2 3 so you can use this uh, ordered list type ol mean ordered list now I am going to make an unordered list so, so that I get the same list here control V and use instead of ol ul uh, here also I will change it as ul uh, but this type should not be that uh, it won't work so I'll delete this uh, now you can see what is happening there uh, refresh yes this is what default uh, bullets this is numbering list this is bullet list so we can get some types of bullets like uh, typ type you will type equal circle a quotation within quotation c i r c l d circle circle when I save 
you can see it as yes circle if I use here square S uh, S Q not the Q Q U R E S Q U A R E I think is square A R E A R E square so I will save it and uh, refresh let's see yes it is spelling also correct then this became square so these are the uh, things that we have done so far I think uh, this is the basic part of the uh, web page so you have to practice this uh, this is marquee how it works here uh, I will explain using these two uh, then I use uh, image uh, this is the image of this web page to get the image I use this IMGSRC this one then here is the uh, uh, HR that means for this line and then I use uh, a paragraph this is paragraph uh, and I make a link there this is the link in paragraph uh, then I close this center and made two list as ordered list and unordered list you see uh, this is the uh, tags I will make it here like this okay now you see uh, this is the head uh, head part of the website and this is the body part uh, this is how I end so you can see I have end uh, my uh, website here uh, HTML uh, and close the tag so these are the uh, tags that I have wrote for the first part uh, yes so you can notice this uh, and if there is any errors you can find it out so looking at this notepad, notepad just try to uh, build up uh, uh, build up a <coughs> uh, website uh, this is what right here uh, so actually uh, uh, now I am going to close this and this is our website so uh, dear children you try to make this uh, website using notepad then in my next video I'll uh, tell you how to use uh, table and some other things here we have to understand actually using a table in a web page is little bit difficult so we have to uh, practice it well before that you must uh, do these basic things uh, remember basic things in the web page uh, so um, now I this uh, because uh, if I make whole uh, HTML this video might be very long so that's why I stop here and make it as two videos so let's meet uh, in my next video uh, for the uh, next part and some uh, question from uh, past papers or some model papers okay uh, be safe goodbye